Well, we struggle a little bit the first half to create chances. Uh, it was almost chances, but we arrived in the final third, like in the first action with Kyle, with a few from Phil and uh, the last part. We were not, you know, precise, and our accuracy was not uh, was not was not good. But uh, we didn't play bad. We didn't concede one shoot and target in 90 minutes. Just one unfortunate score a goal. And the second half to break the line, yeah, was in our bad moment when the game was. Yeah, control because we didn't concede. We won a lot of balls against Watkins. Like for example, the last game last season, we struggled a lot. And uh, yeah, we went zero. Everything is open, and one action that they defend really well. Ninety minutes, one action they defend poor. The second ball, um, so they make a, a good goal. Yeah, it's good. He was involved in the game, not just in the scoring goal, and yeah, make a good assist from Kevin. He was there as always and score another one. He had the chance to score another one because uh, yeah, we was in the first half was almost second half was clear. We another with Erling and with Kevin and two actions with a free kick and one against one against Emiliano and one from Phil. Enough chances to to score, but it's football. It's happened. Sometimes you go in, sometimes go out. But defensively, like everything, offensively in the final third, we were not in place like normally. They are so precise. We miss a lot, but it's happened. But in general, if you analyze the game, the chances we had, the few concede, and and the control we had in many many aspects, knowing that a lot of credit Aston Villa, how we defend inside and aggressive they are, we knew it. So they are a good side, a good team. So we knew it. But yeah, in general, we we could win and. Unfortunately, we dropped. Uh, yeah, as the been substituted, yeah, because had uh, some problem in the first half. He continued, but at the end, at the end, um, at the end, could not continue. We'll see. I, I didn't speak with the doctors. Yeah, that's good. But football is not just one and two players; it's everyone. And the performance in general was was good. Was was better than the opponent. My point of view, maybe. Okay, I'm wrong. But in general, knowing that we cannot expect right here, you know, we score zero four in the in ten minutes. So it's difficult. Was last season was difficult. Away home today. Again, but the chances we produce and uh, how few concede, so in the best moments that we had, so unfortunately we couldn't score more goals and win the game. Overall, how would you describe the start? I'm actually very happy. Overall, how would you describe the start of the season? Is there anything you're unhappy about? No, no. Normally I'm a positive person, so in general uh, you analyse every game, the performance every game, it's just one game, I more always transition in a few minutes, like it was against Newcastle, but even in that game, we create much, much more. Always the target as a team is create more than open and you can see few. This is a balance, a good measure how you are playing. And in all the games, we were much better. But we dropped four points away, And uh, but it's normal. Nothing will change winning or losing today. Your draw is a lot of games and keep going. And, and now Champions League. Yeah, it's not my first season here. So it's seven. I know every game away is difficult. It was in Newcastle, it was today. Look at the results. Everyone wins or tight. I know how difficult it is. And the opponents are really good. Um, that's why what we won in the past is because it's so difficult. And this will not be an exception. So I understand the people, you know, what the people talk. But I know that it's just the beginning and a lot of things are going to happen.